If you're trying to avoid thinking, here's how. For the Chuck Colson Center for Christian Worldview, I'm John Stone Street with The Point. As we enter the heat of the political season and as the issues on the table become more significant for our culture, it's never been more important to know how to listen to others and engage in sound thinking. But in the satirical words of blogger Sarah Geis, maybe we should conclude that valued reason, fair disagreements, and good listening skills are overrated. In that case, she has some advice for you, like assume that anyone who disagrees with you is personally attacking you, or even better, that they're racist or full of hate. You could ignore any nuances in their argument or skip ahead to their conclusion and ignore their arguments altogether. You could also decide to make up new definitions to their words, or more commonly, consider your personal feelings about an issue as being the same as having actual evidence or reason. Geist's tongue-in-cheek points would be funny if they weren't so common. For ThePointRadio.org, I'm John Stone Street.